welcome to the part 6 of build custom ROM series and here this is particularly for beginners who doesn't know device tree and is looking for their device tree so I will explain what device trees is and some places you can find them and also I'll be making a video on how to make a device tree from scratch so that you get the fundamental knowledge and then the advanced knowledge on how to do that so let's begin so device trees are basically it's like a data structure that describes the hardware component of a particular device so that the operating system uh, the operating system kernels can make use of those components so i don't know how to explain this into details but it it simply means uh let's say if you have if you don't have a device tree and then you build a rom the ROM isn't going to know which kind of uh, hardware component it is running on and with that it will not be able to even boot at the first place it will not be able to identify the partition and it will not be able to uh, boot uh, successfully so with the device tree it has all these data structures built into it which uh, integrates themselves with the hardware component so that if the operating system is installed to the phone the kernel can identify them and make use of them so that is basically what device tree means well every device on this world have a device tree even the iphone has a device tree without that ios cannot be installed on any other iphone you can find in this world for that reason we have to uh, begin by looking for our device tree well in case you don't know where to find it this video is basically for you the first thing you have to do is to come to the lineageos.org in case you are a beginner and you don't know this, come to the lineageOS.org and click on Get Lineage OS. And then if you click on the Get Lineage OS, click on the filter here and then click on uh, this one. Uncheck this. It says Hide Discontinued Device. Just uncheck it. And then uh, you can just leave the rest as it is. And then click on Apply. Now that you have clicked on the Apply, it loads this for you. Just click on the Samsung or where. Uh, which one is your device so if you know you come back to this list and then you go through the list uh, it is a lot of device here so you go through the list here if you have any of these phones please just click on any of them and then i'm using samsung galaxy f52 so i just click on the samsung here and then uh when we check through this list we have samsung galaxy f52 not a 52s so it's a 52 4g that i'm using so here we have this all of these devices that have been uh, supported by Lineage OS, which means Lineage OS have the device trees and has made a custom ROM for them. So we can grab the Lineage OS device tree and make modifications on it to build our new custom ROM that we'll be making. So here you can see there are a lot of Samsung devices supported in the past and even supported currently. So all we need is the device tree, not the Lineage OS. We want device trees. Some people might be interested in getting a Lineage OS working on their device it's no problem you can just go for it but some of them are discontinued and you need to build for yourself so well you we have uh, my phone here which is samsung galaxy a52 so i'm good to go well if you haven't found your phone here let me show you another way to get it done so well you need to search github so you have to know the processor inside your phone in case you don't know the processor inside your phone just go to play store and look for phone info or device info and then if you download this app get your processor from there and then you can set the processor name here so mine is snapdragon 720g then you type code name so you can see it says Qualcomm Snapdragon 720G, which has this code name SM7121, 7205. And then you have to search this one uh, on GitHub. So you can just copy this one like this and then search, paste it, and then uh, search device tree. Just search uh, Samsung, something like that. Then hit on enter. So if you hit an enter, you can see that it's not actually searching from GitHub. For that reason, you just have to come to this place and put this uh, one here, sites.github.com. Hit on enter. And then you can see it says SM7205 GitHub Topics. 
well if you come to this side let me go to the github topics and there are a lot of topics that spoke of this and you can see there are a lot of phones that have this and as you can see here we have samsung kennel here uh, for both samsung uh, a52 and samsung a72 so they have the same processor but when you come down here let's come back to uh, this search history at this place and then you can see we only have from github so here you can go through any of this one we have the vendor here uh, my vendor tree which you can see here samsung galaxy a52 my code name is a52q and also you can uh, it's still sma75f sorry a52f so as you can see i have searched from github and i see i've seen a little uh, uh, things that can help me here well in case you can't find your uh, processor code please every phone has a processor code please just search for it and then do that if that doesn't work for you just go to uh, search your phone like this samsung a52 q or you can just leave the queue if it's 4g just do a52 4g or if it's just a52 type the a52 and you can go to the github topics i've gone there already so i'm just demonstrating it for you to see if you go to the topics you can see that we have some development for it so uh it actually exists and when you also have any of these device just set your device here and then uh, look for it on github there are many ways to get it on github and this is one of the ways especially the github topics really does uh, does well in looking for a specific uh then a specific thing that you want it can be the device tree it can be something else it can be magic whatever it is you just have to search like what i'm doing here well if you find it on uh, if you try finding your device on github your device tree you can't find it on github the next thing you can do is to go to xda forum so if you go to the sda forums here just click on the sda forums and if you go inside the sda forums you have to scroll down a bit and come to all categories at your categories just click on see all and it's going to show you all these devices so please and please and please just choose your device from here and i'm using samsung so i just have to click on the samsung and it's going to give me an sda thread on uh, the samsung device i'll be selecting from this place and as you can see when we came to the lineage wiki here we have some phones that uh, are kind of not available in the lineage wiki so when you come to the sda forum we have a lot of devices there also so well uh, if in case it is uh, samsung m42 any phone that you are having just click on it and if you click on it from here you are going to see sda threads here so here you can see we have twrp for it uh, we can see some people are asking for the uh, TWRP for Samsung Galaxy A52, uh, sorry, A, uh, F42. So uh, that is uh, A52, A22 5G and then F42. So kindly go through this list and come to the recovery section. You can see that somebody has made a TWRP recovery for Samsung A22 5G, which means this phone actually has uh a development going on it you can build a custom room for this device if you are having this device so actually you have to go through this list and look for something that is related to device trees or custom recoveries which is twrp orange fox or anything like that so here you can just go back and then uh keep looking for devices so uh can you look for your device from this side in case you have looked for it and you can't find your device tree from this list well you have to make a device tree yourself which is what i'll be uh, posting a video on uh making a device tree uh is not an easy thing it is very huge and it's not uh, a thing a straightforward thing so uh the videos i'll make it a playlist so if you can't find your device tree right now kindly have patience but there are other options for you if in case you are using a samsung device so here as you can see uh this is the three ways you can look for device trees uh that is currently huge that you can get device trees also you can also search gitlab let me give you as a bonus so github is just the same as gitlab so if you search uh, gitlab for example then you search the uh, sm uh, 7205 which is your processor code name and then you can see that we have some cool stuff going on here so you can see at the gitlab we have uh, for xiaomi 
so i didn't add a samsung but you can see we have we found samsung device yeah as uh, some common device tree here so as, as you can see this is basically for my device samsung galaxy a52 so this is just like a bonus for you to uh search for your device tree so please don't forget any of this can you search according to your processor your device code name and also your uh, devices uh model number so you need to know all of this and search from these sites and also you can search from uh telegram if you want and i'll be putting certain links in the telegram uh in my description to reach out these telegram groups and ask for help like i said in the previous video so well this is uh this video is to educate you on getting your device trees so now that you have seen the ways to search for your device trees please go and look for your device trees and then watch the next video which is going to uh, help you in cloning the device trees and now using them in your custom room to begin building the room so well see you in the next one goodbye